My name is Alberto Del Saz. Uh, I was born in Spain and I came to New York in 1983. Most people know me by Tito. I started as a figure skater and then I decided that I wanted to change careers so I came to New York and I became a dancer. From the first time I came, you know, I felt a, a strong connection to the program and to the students. And this, this second time around, it has been the same. I, you know, I felt that I was very welcome and the dancers are eager to learn, to explore. A choreographer cannot ask for anything better than having a group of people that actually want to be there. They are ready to work. They are uh, willing to explore and experiment. The last couple of days I've been driving them a little crazy because I keep going back to something and I totally change it from the day before. Uh, I work very fast in the beginning, so the first couple of days they were extremely exhausted mentally and physically because there was a lot of information. Uh, today we are going to be in the theater for the first time. Things may not work the way I wanted them to work in the classroom, in the studio. So today is kind of a quick test of what hopefully the final product would be at the end of, of the residency. Yeah. I never treat them as students, you know, the moment I step into the studio, they become professionals to me. So I hope they understand what it is to experience, what it is to be in that professional environment where you have to always give it 100% regardless, regardless of the circumstances. I've been in dance now for over almost 40 years. Often we forget that imagination is almost like a muscle. So if you don't exercise the muscle, often we, we lose that you know, connection. Because for me, it's always about sharing my knowledge and seeing how that hopefully make a difference. Mm -hmm.